love every aspect of the job and, and what I do and I think that it was uh, whenever I was reached out and said I was even nominated for it was was crazy to me but whenever I was informed that I won it, it was insane. It was amazing. I started within the youth sector, started volunteering as part of the T-Buck Camps programme and I was there as a participant. If I hadn't started on this programme, I wouldn't be doing anywhere close to what I'm doing now. It took that initial personal development for me to go out and want to do this sort of stuff. You know, you need a mentor, you need someone to believe in you and I, I believe that I could be that person for the young people that I work with. I needed it whenever I was younger as a participant, whenever I was going through the development programmes, whenever I was trying to get the qualifications, I was just trying to make something of myself. I needed that person to stand behind me and, and just let me know that it's not everything is so confined. You can go out and be yourself and, and gain a lot from it. I think that if you're if you're always stuck in your echo chamber in the same wee area that you come from, then you keep reusing the same ideas that your community maybe stereotypically has. If you go and you meet other people and you go and have that as part of you, it means that you're more open-minded, you're able to express yourself a wee bit better and, and it means that you're not confining yourself and making yourself, uh, putting yourself in a box so you can't go anywhere in the future. It means that you're, you know, you're putting your own barriers in front of you, just embracing it and just try and break down those barriers yourself.